What's up everyone, we're back for another episode of Code Geass and in the last episode we basically saw how the people who were mysteriously teleported to this island escaped. Since we still don't know who CC was talking to, who was the one who teleported them there, then it's gonna be a mystery for now. Now the last episode also had plenty of shocking revelations for the characters, for example Eufemia figured out that Lelouch is actually zero and that he's alive and Kalin told Suzuku that she's a part of the Black Knights. She told him the truth. So yeah, I wonder if he's gonna turn her into the police if he can or if he's gonna keep quiet about it. Anyways, let's start watching this episode. Dang, so Japan was preparing this shit the whole time. I'm pretty sure they are not connected, right? Yep. Hold up, he quit? What a nice guy. He remembered? Why is this dude so full of justice? Dang, they're actually doing a lot of damage? They came prepared. Would you look at that? Lelouch, Suzuku, and Kalin aren't there. They haven't even suspected that he's part of the Black Knights? I guess not. Oh, she's still thinking about that letter? Yo, I thought he was never gonna have to worry about her again, but I guess not. Because of that stupid letter. So he's doing this for her. Always looking out for other people. It's hard. How do you save them? So could you imagine if she ends up joining the Black Knights? Oh no, she's gonna meet Ophemia. <laughs> she better not fangirl and go crazy. Dang, so they're just fakes. Hold up, Tokyo? An independent nation? Exactly, that's a big mission right there. That's right, man. That day is today. How is he gonna do it? I have no clue. Yo, hold up. What's going on here? Man, she's willing to go to jail just to thank her? Listen, you can send a letter. It's alright. Man, this is gonna be an air battle. What kind of shield is that? You're telling me this dude is gonna fly now? What the hell? 
It's Lancelot's with a goddamn jetpack and wings. Is it as good in the air as it is in the ground? I don't know. How the hell is, is he so good at using the jetpack? When did he practice? Oh, they actually recognized him? Think she actually invited her for tea and everything? What a nice girl. And gave her clothes? Exactly, they're both in the same boat. Are they going to become good friends after this or something? This guy is always talking about the right way. I don't even know what the right way is, to be honest. Is she going to help out in the battle? Oh, she probably wants to talk with Suzuku, huh? Hold up, what's she about to say? <laughs> what? What kind of demand is that? <laughs> Alright, well my boy just got himself a girlfriend. <laughs> this isn't usually how it happens, but... Are you telling me he likes her back? Well, I mean, she demanded it, so he's got no option. Here it is, the power of love, the most powerful thing. Yo, he's not gonna die, is he? No. Oh, shit. Hold up! What happened? Did the Black Knights hijack their weapon? Is that Toto? Wait, that's CC. Oh, CZ and Zero. Oh, that shit's broken. They fixed it. Of course, she's the one who did it. That's right, man. They came to help you out. Come on, remember the Gias. He told you to live. What? Yo, they're finally working together. This isn't how I expected it was gonna be, but it's still nice to see. Exactly, man, it's all bullshit. They're fighting together. That is true, man. She reveals her identity. That's right, man. The Black Knights aren't evil. Alright, they're fucked. Their helicopter got destroyed. They're probably not even going to mention Zero, are they? That's right, man. They're just giving all the credit to Cornelia.
Alright, well, this is kind of awkward now. Alright, well, you gotta admit that the current government does not achieve that. Alright, well, to people smiling. Well, that was pretty cool. We finally got to see Suzuku and Lelouch fighting side by side together. However, it wasn't in the way I think it would ever have happened. I thought it's not those two fighting against Britannia, it's those two fighting against some people from the Chinese Federation. It was still pretty cool that we got to see that though. Zero really showed his message about justice, about him not just being this terrorist group that's trying to get rid of Britannia. Suzuku, however, I'm sure that he still is never gonna understand that. He's gonna be fighting happily at the side of the love of his life, Elfemia. Sadly for the Black Knights though, the news did not mention Zero at all did not mention his help. Everything they said was that it was Princess Cornelia, but little by little, he's getting a good reputation. That was a good episode. I can't wait for the next one, so I'll see you there, and I hope you guys stick around.